She starred opposite Benedict Cumberbatch in the hit movie Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. She's also our youngest competitor this season. It's 17-year-old Sochi Gomez and her partner Val Schmierkowski. I'm Sochi Gomez, I'm an actress, and I have done lots of stunts, but I don't really know like ballroom dancing. Stunts are hard, ballroom's hard. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> now, here we are, Dancing with the Stars. I can't believe it. <laughs> Hi, Hi, can I hug you? <laughs> how are you? I'm so good, how are you? Nice to meet oh you. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. My partner is Val, and I'm very excited about it. On a scale of one to 10, it's a 10. I'm only 16. I okay. just turned six. No, no, I'm 17. Oh my God, how did I forget that I'm only 17? <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> she is such a bundle of energy, so I'm excited to teach her how to dance. I want to know what you know about ballroom dancing. Nothing. <laughs> Um, I mainly just do kind of like TikTok dances. So that's kind of why I appreciated everything you did with Zendaya, just because of how young she was and having to think outside of the box. So our first dance is okay. gonna be the cha-cha. So you push, whoa, cha-cha's fast. And I think that is a good first dance to show my personality. <laughs> and we want to balance, obviously. We don't want a chaos in our routine. The cha-cha requires a lot of energy, and Sochi has a lot of it. What we need to do now is channel that energy. Let's go again. Big, big. I've never really been like judged or scored for anything, so a little jitters, but I'm ready. <laughs> Dancing the cha-cha with her partner Val Jmerkowski, it's Sochi Gomez. This week, as she trained to explore another dimension with her salsa, our Marvel star revealed a minor phobia. It's Sochi Gomez and Val Shmikovsky. Our little Marvelette, your potential is enormous. Six. Fourth highest score. I feel great, but we can improve our scores, maybe, fingers crossed. <laughs> It's Latin night. We are dancing the salsa to Camila Cabello. Let's go. With a name like Sochi Gomez, you'd expect I was born knowing how to do salsa, but that is not the case at all. Being that we're one of five doing the salsa, we got to throw in a couple of jumps. Now is probably the worst time to tell you, but I do have a little bit of a fear of heights. Six, seven, eight. I'm kind of nervous just because I don't really like to show my fear. I saw you do this in a movie. How do you make it look so graceful? I could do as many takes as I want. But on the ballroom floor, we only have one shot. It's live. You get what you get. Don't get upset. Wow, these. <laughs> Dancing the salsa with her partner Val Jmerkowski, it's Sochi Gomez.
It's Marvel star Sochi Gomez and Val Smirkovsky. Oh my God, so oh, I am Nancy. Eight. Having all eights being the highest score of the season, I was like, smile, 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 don't cry. <laughs> but when those eights rolled out, I was like, let's go. Go, bro. Oh, that's how you felt? With two rows, yeah. <laughs> okay. This is Motown night. Believe it or not, it's not from my generation. Oh my gosh. Uh, but our dance is timeless. 70 years later, someone could watch it and be like, wow, that had hella riz. Hella riz, bro. What even is that? Well, it's short for charisma. Okay, that makes sense. I'll get better. <laughs> it's very, very slow. Drag. The Foxtrot is elegance. <laughs> Posture, completely different from everything we've done. Now you gotta take more steps. You have to glide and to make it look one like it's so minute. graceful, but it's really hard. Oh, man. One more time. I wanna show that I can be refined this week Five, six. and have hella riz. Oh. Dancing the Foxtrot with her partner Val Jamaikovsky, it's Sochi Gomez. See what happened in training when Sochi Gomez and Val Shmerkowski went un poco loco. The quality of movement was fantastic. Eight. Our dance was possibly the best dance I've done yet. I really felt proud of myself. What up? What are you doing here? I thought I'd pick you up, take oh you to God. rehearsal. Okay. See you right. Cool. This week is Disney 100 night. Yeah. Are you excited? I was actually born right across the street from the Disney lot. So I think it's fair to say that this is pretty full circle. Oh, yeah. All right, let's get to rehearsal. Okay. Want to know what we're dancing to? Duh. <gasps> I love this song. What color is the sky? I'm your moon, I'm your moon. Tell me that it's red. I'm your amor, I'm your amor. You make me un poco loco, un poquitito loco. Keep me guessing. I'm nodding and I'm guessing. Senor is a blessing. <laughs> that I'm only un poco loco. You know the energy that you performed this song with just now? I need you to bring that into the dance. Okay. <laughs> do this, do this. Boom. This week with the Paso Doble, I know that the judges are gonna be looking for a different aggression. Yeah! There you go. The dramatic, fiery side is really hard. I've never seen Val this extreme. Boom, something big. When he like did his little I was scared. Literally a little piece of my heart was like Poof. Why are we panicking? This is so hard. Un Poco Loco is a song that I love so much, so I want to do it justice, and I want to make Val proud. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Hopefully I can match his energy. This is hard work. Dancing the Paso Doble with her partner Val Jamaikovsky, it's Sochi Gomez. Put them on your head. 
Ay, mi amor, ay, mi amor. You make me un poco loco, un poquitito loco. The way you keep me guessing, I'm nodding and I'm guessing. I'll count it as a blessing that I'm only un poco loco. It's Sochi Gomez and Val Shmirkovsky. What I love so much about you, you're showing your power, but in such a beautifully animated and light way. Amazing! Nine! Oh my gosh, highest score in season. Three nines. Let's go! We did a little bit better than I expected, not gonna lie. What is your most memorable year? 2021. I was on this amazing project. Movie? Yes. I was the wow. first Latina superhero. That's huge. It didn't click until the premiere, and there's so many people screaming my name. It's really cool. <laughs> How did your life change? My life movie. changed a lot. I didn't get the chance to have my quinceanera. So yes. you're celebrating your 15th, 15th birthday. birthday. Wow. Yeah. I was so sad that I didn't get to have it. I decided to rent a big ball gown and I went all over LA and then I put it on Instagram. They didn't look odd for LA at all, probably. No, it did not. 2021 was Sochi's most memorable year. It was the year that she booked her dream movie, but missed out on having her quinceanera that she dreamed of. Uh, so I just want to create a moment that is going to be a memory for her to cherish for a long time. Ultimately, this becomes your moment. You're a little nervous, you're a little excited. I want Sochi to keep her head held high and dance with the Viennese Walls Proud. And stop, nice. Until I Found You is my comfort song. Hey. I was a little bummed to not do it at my quinceanera, but you know, I get to do it tonight and hopefully I get to do it justice. Oh, ho, 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 ho. wonderful. <laughs> Dancing the Viennese Waltz with her partner Valch Merkowski, it's Sochi Gomez. Georgia. I want you in my arms, oh, let me hold you. I'll never let you go again like I did or I Sochi Gomez and Val Schmerkowski. The maturity of movement was perfection. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. Nine, ten! I got my first ten, and I literally was like jumping for joy. I was so excited. I was not expecting a 10, especially from Derek. I was just like... Yeah, that's a big deal. We did that. I just feel proud. We just got to keep going, right? The expectations yeah. are now higher. Fingers crossed it works out. All right, it's monster night. How do you feel about Halloween? 
As a kid, I had a hard time trick-or-treating. I get scared so easily. I'm like a little baby, it's not good. So, you know, this is a little out of my comfort zone. So you don't go out on Halloween at all? Uh, I try not to. Okay. Last week we saw five contemporaries that were very reflective of an emotional story. But for Monsters Night, it's an opportunity to tell fictional stories. So I am playing a character inspired by Moonlight Comics. It's Sochi Gomez. That has the power to bring Sochi back to life from the dead. It evolves into a triumphant moment for both of us. I'm feeling pretty good about this contemporary because it allows me to use my acting skills to tell a story, which is perfect for me. How scary! There's a lot of pressure to keep up with the new standard we set last week, Sorry. but I am pretty confident that this dance will resurrect the 10 paddle again. Is that what they taught you in superhero school? <laughs> yes. Dancing contemporary with her partner, Vouch Merkowski, it's Sochi Gomez. Well, it's Sochi Gomez and Val Shmurkovsky. You're such a powerful performer. Nine, nice. ten, baby! I'm gonna be honest, that ten felt really good. And then somehow we won the dance marathon. Sochi and Val! You know, this is a competition, and you gotta continue to do your best each week, and hopefully this week we can do that. So, it's music video night? Yeah, I've actually directed my first small music video for a friend. I was able to tell a story about a girl who felt like she was second choice. Having a concept come to life, it was just really exciting. That's awesome. It's music video night. We're dancing jazz to Holla Back Girl by Gwen Stefani. If I could be somebody, it would be Gwen Stefani. I love her personality, and this is one of the most exciting performances. Ten-year-old me just like... So one of the things that is iconic about this video is her little posse. So you're gonna have a little posse. Sochi is a music video director. Let's do it again from the top. And I believe Sochi's creative vision and genuine passion for Gwen Stefani will make this one of her best performances of the season. Everything Gwen does is larger than life, so I have to bring that same presence to our performance. I'm taking on more creative control on this performance, so I'm definitely feeling the pressure on this one. Like a, I'm just hoping I can pull it off and go bananas. Yes. <laughs> -E Dancing Jack with her partner Val Merkowski. It's Sochi Gomez.
Sochi and Bell. When I was in high school, I was never the captain. So I got to make up for young Harry. Have you got any team names? We're the younger side as a team. And we're dancing to Gangnam style. So maybe it's Youngun style. I like that. Come on. All right, let's do it. Yeah. Let's go. Youngun style. This is what it is. This is a classic Gangnam style move. Gangnam style. What you're going to do with your feet is you're just switching weight. We're really trying to mimic a music video. You have your hand here, and you're whipping. And Harry's in charge of the party. giant party. <laughs> this is Harry's big moment. Oh, oh three, Gangnam style. four. Look and it's going to be so much fun. One, two, three, four. Our dance has group sections, but it also has solos. You've got like a bunch of different personalities, and it's really nice to work together rather than against each other. Woo! You're really good at technique. Yeah. Help me out here. So five, six, seven. Marshmallow. Marshmallow. Charity is helping me, like with my refinement. Like you're squeezing a marshmallow. Okay, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm helping her, you know, attack and perform. <laughs> yeah. Our team is young. We have stamina, and we can do hard lifts. We're going for it. Just take me back to my cheerleading days, but it's a lot of pressure to get the biggest move of the dance right. Oh! Okay. There you go. <laughs> That's That's no okay. Team four, everybody, you're going down and we're bringing the heat. Good! The strength of our team is funk, power, speed. We need those extra points because right now we're in the middle and I don't want to fall down the leaderboard. I don't want to be the weakest link because if I don't win, I could be going home. Team Young and Star! Performing the team dance, it's Team Young and Star. Open Gangnam Style. Gangnam Style. and Valsh Murkowski in training. You were kind of not quite on it as usual, but you know that. Hey. Hi. I was disappointed with the wardrobe mishap. So two nines and two eights felt awful. So last week. I was mad. The hat, the jacket worked everywhere. But the live show. Having that happen really changed my energy. It was a great wake up call. We got comfortable. We got a little comfortable. And we got humble for it. Yeah. It was just a rough two days in a row. You also twisted your ankle the day before. During our team dance rehearsal, I sprained my ankle. The fall looks nasty. Like literally my foot went like this. I actually injured the same foot when I was filming Doctor Strange. So I just hope we can give it our all this week. We're doing the Tango 2, I Wanna Dance With Somebody by Whitney Houston. Do you know that song? Yeah. It's an iconic freaking song. It's a classic. 
I need to get back in frame. Remember you said that. <laughs> Eight hands. That was scary. The tango is way more explosive, way more dynamic. How was your foot? Really weak. So this injury definitely limits her. I'll bring you some ice. I am not an aggressive person by nature, so I'm a little out of my comfort zone. I feel like a failure. After last week's mishap and now this ankle injury, this is the first week of rehearsals where I'm really worried that I might not be able to do this dance at 100%. Holy. Dancing the tango with her partner Valch Merkowski, it's Sochi Gomez. Sochi and Val, the toe in a chop chop battle. Here's how they train to win the judges' bonus points. We we'll win the marathon, team dance, you know which one we're going for, trifecta. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no way! No way! I'm really sad that I have to go against Charity. You hear this confidence? She's already feeling like guilt. Because we are going to win this thing. Oh my gosh, what? I love that. May the best win. I love you, Sochi, but this is not a friend fest. This is a fight fest. Okay, we are doing a cha-cha to So Emotional by Whitney Houston. Okay. You've done cha-cha with Ezra. Okay. We also did the cha-cha. Week one, that was our first dance. We okay. got all, all sixes. sixes. What did you get? Um, I think it was all sevens. Yeah. What? I'm just letting you know, I'm not backing off. Ooh. He wanted me to like <laughs> One, two, Three. You do a good cha-cha is sharp, quick movements, kick, the beautiful hip action, a lot of energy between the partners, and a good showmanship on the floor. Kick. Ta, ba, ba. Oh, that's oh, not wow. right. Charity is very clean and, and precise. Okay. So she is vibrant and alive. Precision and hop versus fire. In turn, whack. I know, so she's gonna bring performance. She's gonna bring the energy. If you kick. Kick with energy. Beautiful. Jerry and Artem are very precise, and when I did the cha-cha, the judges said my arms are a little flappy, so I will definitely have to step up my game. Ooh, I just need that. If the points are right here. What are you gonna do? They're mine! Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna bring my very, very best, so good luck, Sushi and Belle. What? Terry and Artem, you want a cha-cha against us? Well, guess what? Cha-cha challenge accepted. accepted. <laughs> Dancing the cha-cha, it's Sochi Gomez and Val Chmerkovsky versus Charity Lawson and Artem Chigvintsev. Let the dance-off begin. I don't know why I like it. <laughs> I just do.
Mendes, and Val Smirkovsky. I can tell you guys are going for gold. That was fantastic. The first perfect score of the season for a couple. Like, that's pretty awesome. I think it's a moment that Val and I will never forget. I feel so good. Proud of you. Yeah. Because now the expectations are high. That's a lot of pressure. So we're doing the quick step to Paper Rings by Taylor Swift. Are you a big Taylor Swift fan? Yes. I went to the Eras tour with my friends. I love Taylor Swift. I think she's a wonderful role model. She's really paved the path for young girls. Taylor and I have a lot in common. Yeah. She was successful at a young age, and she has a really close relationship with her mom, and I have that too. My mom is always there for me. She comes every day to rehearsals with me. She's sacrificed a lot for me, and I couldn't have done any of this without my mom. We have to make Taylor proud. We do. Nice to meet you. The speed of the quick step, you're doing a thousand steps per minute while in frame. What? I hate this. And so any little lapse of strength <gasps> will show up immediately. It's okay. Ooh, hi. Hey. My team consists of me, my mom, and Val. You're always, you're always outside. Here. Yes. So we wanted to invite you in. Yeah. yeah, we wanted to show you our dance this week. Yeah. Having her here has been really beneficial to this process. Sacrificing my job and all the long hours, the rehearsals, the driving back and forth, it's all been worth it to see Sochi living out her dream. I messed up a little, but it's OK. That's OK. Congratulations. Thank you. That seems really hard to do. Yeah. You guys get back to work. Thank you. Having another perfect score would be amazing. Not only would it make my mom proud, but it would mean so much to me. Oh! <laughs> Dancing the quick step with her partner Val Jamaikovsky, it's Sochi Gomez. Sochi Gomez and Val Smirkowski. You bring every dance to life. I want to see you in the finals. Nice. 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 Getting into the semifinals. This wasn't something that I thought would happen, yet I'm here. So I am so happy. <laughs> Semi-finals, baby, let's go. Let's go. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm so happy. I know, me too. I just didn't think I'd make it this far. I thought I'd make it to like week five. Really? Yeah. As a little kid, I used to fake it and pretend like I knew how to dance for an audition. So embarrassing. But here we are at the semifinals, and I think it's fair to say I've made it. I just hope that if there's roles out there that have dance involved, that I can do them. You get that, that, that Oscar, I'll be there. You'll be there. Okay, first round is the Latin round, and we're doing the Samba. Isn't that hard? Very hard, yes. <gasps> Man, okay. But Samba is a celebration, which is perfect, because being in the semifinals is a perfect time to not just work hard, but to celebrate. And out. The Samba is no easy feat. Oh my gosh, how am I gonna be able to do all that? 
Technically, this routine is really hard. One, One and a two, two and a three and four. Okay. A lot of rhythmical action, but at the same time also physically demanding. I think that's going to be our biggest challenge. How do you do that? Straighten your legs. Okay. I can't believe we saved one of the hardest dances for the semifinal. Four, five, six, Whoa. seven, eight. Whoa, that is so far. So I need to be able to master the rhythm, the tempo, the beat. Ooh, one. Ooh. And it's hard. Seven. Ooh. I have not gotten a single 10 for any of the Latin dances I've done. Nice. So I'm determined to make this performance flawless. Three, gorgeous. Yeah. Dancing the Samba. With her partner, Valch Mayakovsky, it's Sochi Gomez. Sochi and Val in training. Our second dance will be a ballroom dance. This dance will potentially get us into that finale. We've had such a journey. This entire experience has been life-changing. I never thought that I'd be this good of a dancer, so getting into the finale would be fabulous. The potential of being in the finals. Like, a lot of kids have been telling me that, oh, that's so cool, like, I want to be able to do that too. Because you're cool. I definitely did not share that I ballroom dance with my high school friends. <laughs> I just feel excitement. Well, that's why it's so important, you know, <laughs> to have people like you embrace the style. That's why I just want to honor the effort that we've put in. Being a 17-year-old and doing this show, I've gained a lot of respect for dancers, and the most amazing thing to have in this whole process is people who truly support you. You're gonna have a few moments that are solo driven. I just wanna celebrate you being a real forum star. That's nice, thank you. Hopefully it'll be enough to get us into the finale. I hope so. It'll be enough for me. Me too. Okay, so La Vie en Rose starts with you by the piano. We're dancing to La Vie en Rose from A Star Is Born, and this dance showcases how far we've come and how much I've grown in this competition. I think we're gonna showcase a side of you we haven't seen this season. Is you not just becoming a star, but becoming beautiful, a woman. Okay, so arm up. The slow waltz is a real big challenge. Oh, that's where it is. Yeah. Besides all the technique, footwork, and frame, I love that arm. I think the real magic of this performance will be in how deep Sochi's willing to go emotionally. Beautiful. I'm really proud of this wallet because it's very emotional for the both of us. Nice, it's beautiful. So getting to finale, especially with this dance and with our concept, it would just mean the world to me. Perfect, that's <laughs> awesome. Dancing the Waltz. With her partner, Valj Mayakovsky, it's Sochi Gomez. Des yeux qui font baiser les miens, un riz qui serre sous sa bouche, voilà les portes sans retouche, de la moquelle, j'appartrie. Je vous 
Finale, let's go. <laughs> Get in here. We did it. Yeah. We did it. God. It feels great. Yeah. My dance journey is something that I'm really proud of. Yeah, and last week we had two perfect scores. It's kind of the momentum that I was looking for going into the finale. Yeah. I used to always watch other people's dances on Dancing with the Stars. So being here and making it this far, it's pretty unbelievable. And I'm forever grateful. So the first dance of our finale will be a redemption dance, and we're gonna have a judge tell us which dance they'd love us to redeem. This is scary. Ha ha, what have we got here? <laughs> you stop. Congratulations! You've made it, baby! I am so happy. There's just something about Bruno's energy and his passion for everything he does. Okay, listen. For your redemption dance, you're gonna do the foxtrot. You did it on week three, remember? Yep. You lost balance. There's something happened. I spun one too many times. And another thing that you do is you hit it so cleanly <laughs> that it goes pa, pa. Instead of going one, two, two, infinity. That is where you end. The definition of foxtrot is refined sophistication and elegance. Whoa! And then... With this being the finale, the redemption dance is very important. My God, it feels good. <laughs> Anything lower than a 10 is gonna be a little scary. My darling, stretch it as far stretch as you can. As then as you bring it in. God, can we can bring Bruno in difference? here more often? I'm going to take all of the little bits that Bruno has informed me about, and hopefully I can make him proud and redeem myself with the perfect score. You're a star. Dancing the Foxtrot with her partner Val Tchmerkovsky, it's Sochi Gomez. last week of training. So this is it. The freestyle will be our very last dance together. I'm just so happy that we're here. I had no moment of ever saying, man, I wish I wasn't on this show. And I think that has to do with the fact that we got paired the way we did. 
My partnership with Val has been amazing. And he's also just allowed me to be myself as a like 17 year old girl. I've been on projects where a lot of people don't listen to what I have to say. I've literally been told like, you can't, like who do you think you are to say something, you know? So being here and being able to have that what? is really nice. And that's how I've grown, is being able to know that I can have that. It's a really special quality about you. Thanks. I, I wanted that, especially after becoming a dad. I think that's what my role is, is not to tell you what to do, it's to empower you to do the right thing from your standpoint. Yeah. Becoming a dad this off season definitely changed everything. There's a sense of nurturing and a sense of protectiveness that I felt this season more than ever. This whole thing has actually made me realize that I do have pretty mature qualities and how beautiful it can be. I just want to showcase that alongside you. One last time. One last time. Let's make it the best time. One, two, three. With this freestyle, I get to incorporate my culture. So we are starting with Latin dances, with some paso, tango vibes. And then once that beat drops, I think you're going to see one of the most hype freestyle dances you've seen on Dancing with the Stars. Oh, that was awesome. Working creatively with Val on these dances has been so much fun. Val has truly made me enjoy this experience to the fullest, and I think winning with him, if we did, would be awesome. Dancing freestyle with her partner Val Jamerkowski, it's Sochi Gomez. Oh, my God.